All right, all right, all right. Welcome back, all you Hollow Table heroes. And thank you for joining me again. This is your boy Itachi from Itachi Gaming. Thank you all for stopping by today. All right, so today we're going to talk about some Jedi. I know there's a lot going on right now this week with the General Grievous rework and the droid separatist reworks that are going on and the two new droids that are coming out for them uh with droidica and b1 battle droid which is already out b1 battle droid is but today we're gonna talk about your jedi why because grandmaster yoda is coming tomorrow i know there's all this hype for all those droids and stuff like that but we want to make sure that you are ready to get your five star or seven star grandmaster yoda now Let's uh, first, we're going to start off by looking at the Jedi that I have. Now, this takes any five Jedi, uh, which is great because if you're following my farming uh, and farming the way I, I've talked about, uh, you should have quite a few different Jedi available to you right now. So your first two seven star Jedi should have been uh, Ezra Bridger and uh, Kanan Jarrus. So... They should have been the very first two that you unlocked at seven stars. Uh, they should be at least gear eight right now. Uh, maybe even a little higher, gear nine, gear 10, depending on how you're focusing on your things. All right. So number two, you should have Bastila Sean. And, uh, you know, two, three and four, you should have Bastila Sean and Jolie Bindo. Okay. Um, those guys should have been next on your farming list. Um, because they are needed for Jedi Knight Revan. Sorry, I gotta turn the music down just a bit. All right, there we go. So they're definitely needed for Jedi Knight Revan, and they should have been your next two. Um, and Basila is really going to be um, probably one of your great leaders that are going to be out there for Jedi uh, between her and Jedi Knight Revan. Now. If you were lucky enough to get this done before Jedi Knight Revan and farm all those Old Republic characters, then you have Jedi Knight Revan, uh, which will be your fifth. If you don't have Jedi Knight Revan, then you should have at least Old Ben, good old Benny, um, in your roster. and should have him at least five stars. He unlocks at four stars. Um... And I know we haven't really talked about this yet as far as farming, but uh, he will be on a video uh, talking about CLS and R2-D2 uh, that I'll be putting out here shortly. Um, but you should have old Ben uh, at the very least um, if you're following our farming uh, the way you should be. So I just want to show you guys a video real quick of some Grandmaster Yoda. I call him the little green monster. All right, so we're going here into ground war and assault battles. Um, and here's the team I'm going to use, okay? Um, we've got um, Jedi Knight Revan as our leader, Grandmaster Yoda, um, Basil Sean, Jolie Bendo, and Ezra Bridger here, all right? So we're going to use, and you're going to see how Jedi Knight Revan works here if you have not seen him, uh, which would be cool. And we're just going to see kind of how this guy, why well, I call him a little green monster. All right, you ready? Here we go. All the turns right here. Boom, right? All right, we're going to do that. We're going to spread it around. Whoop. All right. Um, I probably should have waited on that, but that's okay. Uh, we always want Basil to have the extra turns. So that middle ability from Revan, we're going to use on, on her. All right, here we go. Whoop. Done. Look at that. All right, we're going to call him to assist. Now, when I call him assist, he's going to get health and protection because of Jedi Knight Revan. Uh, not that he really needs it right now, but when a Jedi attacks out of turn, they recover some of that. So, some Jolie Bendo here. There we go. All right, we're not going to use Mark yet. We're going to save that. Ooh, target lock. All right, let's take that guy out. Boom. All right, and this is the bonus tier on this, by the way. So um, I do advise trying to take out these B1 battle droids as soon as possible because they're just going to make life miserable for you because uh, you can't spread around any of your buffs. You can't gain buffs. They're going to put on those this buff immunity stuff. Uh, so let's, let's go ahead and cleanse that there. 
Um, we're gonna call Yodas to assist here. Boom. Oh, we gotta get rid of that target lock. All right, here we go. There we go. One turn. We're gonna get that. Spread that around. Oh, I should have paid attention to that. So he cleanses. It was really bad for us. And hopefully they don't kill Jedi Knight Revan. All right, cool. All right, we're going to cleanse here. Boom. Got rid of that target lock. Healed back up. Let's see if we can take care of this B1 battle droid. Ooh, that. All right, here we go. All right, we're just going to do that. Uh, sh this should be enough. There we go. Jolly Binda really isn't going to be used a lot for um, attacking that much. Occasionally he will be. Uh, let's save that. Boom. But you can see how this little green monster, he's bouncing all around the screen. Uh, this is why they're putting up the um, the buff stuff uh, to where you can change all those things uh, to where you don't have as many of these up uh, is because of him. Boom. All right, let's see if we can strip that away. Boom. All right, we're going to take a few turns here. I've got no. All right, that's fine. There we go. Oh, you got some protection up there. The other thing you're going to see with Jedi Knight Revan um, eventually here. Closer towards the end of this. Uh, we actually don't want to waste that. Is that uh, he takes away health when um, your opponents attack out of turn, whereas when you when your guys attack out of turn, they get bonuses. There you go. You saw that that little bit of health gain there or protection gain on Yoda. He's gonna get a lot there. All right, we're not going to use that. We're going to save that up. Going into the next one. I haven't used marked yet. We'll use that probably here coming up on these next couple of ones. Uh, let's save all those for cooldowns. Boom. All right, let's see how fast we can go through these guys. All right, let's give our turn meter over to Basila. All right, we're going to call Yoda to assist. All right. Uh, we're going to call Yoda again. So they're going to attack together. Boom. Now, this team is very, very powerful. Um, it's also powerful with Bastila. So if you have Bastila, um, you can use her as well. I'm actually not going to spread this around again because these guys are almost dead. Whoop. All right, here we go. See how fast we can get rid of him. There we go. Stunned. Call Yoda. Let's remove some turn meter. Boom. And then finish him off. Let's see if I can get through this with three stars. I haven't three starred this one yet, so I'm hoping to be able to do that. I may need to start calling like some of these other guys for assists um, to get their protection back up. Uh, moving on, going into some of these other rounds. So let's call Ezra here. There we go. And let's see if we can boost up Bastila's protection there. And we're going to do the same with Jolie. There we go. All right, we're going to heal everybody up. Boop. All right. All right, here we go. See if we can give this over to Bastila. Oh, she's not there yet. All right, stun. Yes. All right. All right. I'm not going to use... I'm trying to use as the least amount of... Ooh, special abilities as possible because I want to save them all for going into the next round. Let me take this stuff off. Um... There we go. It cleanses. All 
probably should be using this this turn. That's exactly what we're going to do. All right. Let's see if we can get everyone's health back up going into this last round. Health and protection. There we go. All right. Let's call Basila. <clears throat> I just want to make sure I have full health. I'm not going to have full protection, but as close to it as possible. Perfect. So we're going to start off with Yoda. Boom. All right. Oh, I can't spread it around, but that's okay. He's going to take another turn here. Well, let's go after Ventress. Boom. Man, so, like, I just love this. Let's see if we can get... Oh, we're one away. Oh, I thought I was... Okay. That is okay. We're going to spread that around. and Spread this goodness around. There we go. All right. Oh, man. These guys are almost done for. All right. Let's see. Let's just do a basic attack there. Let's call Yoda's. Boom. Uh, and we're going to mark. I'm going to see how much health these guys take. All right. He's going to lose. Anytime he takes out a turn, he's going to lose health. His health bar. You can't really tell. Well, there you go. We got the three star. There you go, Jerry Knight Revan with uh, what I like to call the uh, green monster Yoda. <laughs> so, uh, there we go. Three star that bonus tier. Um, I'm not ready for the mythic tier yet. Uh, gear level 12 is what's required, and we're not going into that. So, let's talk about a little bit where you can find these guys. Uh, so, let's go back to our Jedi. And really, where you can find some of these Jedi. Alright, so Basil Sean. You can be able to find in Dark Side 5B hard, as well as Fleet Battles 2D hard. Um, so once you get that unlocked, uh, I usually farm out of both to try to get her 7 stars as soon as possible. Alright. We got Jolie Bendu. He's going to also be found in Fleet and on a hard node. So he's in 6D hard Dark Side. Um, and then he's also going to be in 4E hard fleet battles. <clears throat> Same thing. If you happen to get that far with your fleet and you're doing really well in fleets, um, you're going to want to farm out of both. Now, you may want to skip that and and uh, or change back and forth between these two when you're farming them. Where you farm, farm her on, on like dark side nodes and farm him on fleet battle um, hard nodes and then switch back over where he's doing hard side nodes and then she's doing fleet battles. So just depending on what you want to do there. Uh, we already know where the Ezra, Ezra and Kanan are at, right? Ezra is going to be in your Cantina battles only. And then Kanan is going to be found in your Squad Arena store. So the quicker you can get top 50, top 100, the more your payouts are going to be, and the quicker you're going to be able to farm him. So that's four. Um, and then if you do not have Jedi Knight Revan unlocked yet, Old Ben is going to be kind of your next one to go there. He's a tank. Uh, he can be found in Cantina Battles. He's going to unlock at four stars. Um, and then you'll just need to get those 65 shards to get him to five stars, and you'll be able to do that. Now, if you feel like you can't get there, uh, Luminara you can also use as a substitute in this team. Um, <clears throat> and she's kind of found everywhere. So you can farm her very quickly. She's in Galactic War Store. Uh, dark side 2e hard light side 3d hard and light side 6a hard so uh, if you need a quick seven star and you're like man i just need that one more character seven stars i need to be able to quickly farm a character uh, luminar is going to be the best bet for that um, one of my suggestions would be to try to get qui-gon jinn as fast as possible um, he's only in cantina battle stores um, but he can dispel your opponents uh, you take away taunts and things like that um, and he can call, he'll call random assist. It's going to be really great. Sometimes with Jedi Knight Revan, if, if you don't have some of the other pieces, the main pieces, which is Revan, uh, Basila, Jolie, Yoda, and then it's a flex spot between General Kenobi, right? Jin Ken, um, or uh, Ezra Bridger, okay? So um, that's all I've got for you guys for today. Um, tune in tomorrow. We're going to do another video. 
Um, I do like Thursdays for updates and things like that, where we're going to talk about the Separatist droids um, and what that means really for Jedi Knight Revan uh, in the arena. Um, so we're going to talk about that tomorrow and any other updates that might come out tomorrow because Thursday is update day. Yay! Maybe some quality life things like, you know, this buy data, data card here we can get rid of. Uh, that'd be nice. I know it's coming. Um, it's supposed to be coming this month or this quarter, not this month. So ready for that quality of life change. I want to be able to play around with my um, my squads and whatnot. But if you like this video, make sure you hit that thumbs up. Um, if you are subscribed, thank you, thank you, thank you so much to all my subscribers. I greatly appreciate it. Um, if you're not subscribed and you like what you see and you want to see more content, please, please, please don't forget to hit that subscribe button. And don't forget the little bell. That bell will notify you when we get a video. All right. So until next time, my friends. Oh.